What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. I hope everyone's doing well today. Today we got the bike delivered, so I'm trying to get the shoes um, ready so we can use the bike. I showed you guys the whole package last time and for this video I just wanted to go over the shoes again and the cleats and everything and how to install it. So what you get it's the shoes right here, it's pretty nice. The bottom's like a piano black right here. Very reflective. Um, it comes with the cleats attached, so I gotta cut this off. But here's the, the second shoe right here. For the family package was four fifty with the hundred dollars off, so three fifty with everything, including the shoes. I thought it was a good deal. If you guys are looking for that one hundred dollar off coupon, I'll leave it in the description below so you guys can take advantage. But here are the shoes and the cleats come in a bag, like so. You get these two plastic cleats right here and in a separate bag you get the allen key allen key the rectangular washers as you can see that it's like a shiny chrome it's pretty nice and the allen screws you guys can see that so these are the cleats there's a right side up and downside I guess and what you do is the shoes like this and on the cleat itself you see these um, three dots right here one two and three you use that to line up with the numbers on the shoe itself so you can see these um, horizontal lines right here one through one three five and seven and these diagonal lines one, three, five, and seven. Um, this is the right side up. You'll see yeah. they'll, they'll have a slot for the washers to kind of get into like that. If you install it the other way, it's backwards. Um, there's no place for the washers to sit in, but you Kind of line it up like so, and by hand, just have it on loosely for all three. It's hard to get your finger in, just use the tool, have it loose so you can adjust later down the line get this last one in right here okay with everything loose um, you want to position this cleat where the ball of your feet is um, but it's going to take a couple of adjustments or a couple of rides for you to adjust it to the way you like it. So right now, I'm just going to put this um, dot pointing to the number 5 and on the bottom, also line it up to the number 5 and we'll just tighten it up. Ok, 
Okay. You want to tighten it up until it forms with the shoe right here. Last thing you want is the cleats to come loose when you're cycling. So everything's on like that. It's pretty much straightforward. So um, you're gonna take a couple of rides and then you're gonna just fine tune it as you go. But yeah, that's pretty straightforward. The uh, only other thing I wanted to show was the the operation of the shoe, I guess. It's two Velcros, which is straightforward. But this, um, this strap right here, it's kind of similar to your roller blades and roller skates. Uh, to tighten it, you push it down, but to loosen, you don't, you don't use this lever right here. This is to tighten it. Um, what you do is you press down right here where you see the triangle. You press down and you pull it out. All right, all right guys, that's pretty much all I have for you this week for the Peloton. But if you guys have any questions or anything like that, please leave it in the comments section down below. Otherwise, have a great day and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye.